Do you want to learn how to spawn in all the things you need to travel through the Aberration Portal? And meet our old friend, the Rockwell Boss? Hi, buddy! What's up guys, I'm Fatty McButterpants and today I'm going to be showing you how to spawn in all the things you need to travel through the Aberration Portal. This includes 4 Aberration Artifacts and a bunch of other rare things you will need to collect to travel through the portal. If you like this video or it helps you out, give me a like and also don't forget to subscribe for more videos just like this one. Turn on that bell so you get notified when more awesome videos just like this get rolled out. If you guys don't know how to use admin commands, go ahead and check out the card up top and that will show you how to use them. But otherwise, we're going to get into spawning in these things. Alright, so we're going to start off with the artifacts and the first one is GFI space artifact AB space 1 space 1 space 0. Go ahead and spawn that in and that will get you artifact of the depths. I'm going to go ahead and take this guy and put it on a pedestal because I think it's so cool. Nope, I'm going to mess up first and then oh, I'm going to go put it on. There it is. All right, disregard that mess up. That didn't happen. All right, next up we're going to be doing GFI space artifact AB underscore 2 space 1 space 1 space 0. And that gave us artifact of the shadows. Here we go. Switch this over and put this guy up on a pedestal too. And one day it... There we go. Hup. Hup. There we go. All right, guys. Next up, the next artifact we're going to be spawning in the admin command is a GFI space artifact AB underscore three space one space one space zero. And there we go. Gave us artifact of the stalker. We're going to go ahead and select this guy and, of course, put him on the pedestal as well. There we go. It's all shiny and purple. Ta da. Or pink. Whatever. All right, here we go. Next one, GFI, space artifact, AB, underscore four, space one, space one, space zero. And that gave us artifact of the lost. Select this guy, put him on there so you can see it. Ta-da, let's display these artifacts. All right, guys, so there are the four new artifacts in Aberration. All right, so next up, we're gonna be spawning in the Basilisk scale, and that is GFI, space apex drop underscore basilisk space one space one space zero after you have that go ahead and hit enter and look on the left hand side of the screen and what do you know we're going to spawn in a basilisk scale the next rare item you're going to need is the nameless venom and that is gfi space nameless venom space one space one space zero go ahead and hit enter and watch this guy appear on the left hand side of your screen there it is. All right, guys, so the next thing we're going to need is we're going to need a pheromone gland. So type in GFI space pheromone gland space one space one space zero, and that will give us the pheromone gland from the Reaper. Go ahead and enter that bad boy and look on the left hand side of your screen. One Reaper pheromone gland was added. Next up, we're going to need a rock drake feather, and that command is GFI space apex drop underscore rock drake space one space one space zero after you have that typed in go ahead and hit enter and then look on the left hand side of your screen there it is rock drake feather was added all right so the next thing we're going to need is a basilisk fang and that is gfi space apex drop underscore basilisk underscore alpha space one space one space zero there it is, one alpha basilisk fang was added. Next up, we're gonna need a carcanose claw, and that admin command is GFI space apex drop underscore crab claw space one space one space zero. And then hit on the right hand side of your screen, hit enter, and look on the left hand side of your screen, you'll see it spawned in. And there it is, alpha carcanose claw. Last but not least, we are going to need a Reaper Barb, and that command is GFI space apex drop underscore Reaper Barb space one space one space zero. And then once you're done with that, of course, hit enter and look on the left hand side of your screen after you administer that. Alpha Reaper King Barb. 
All right, guys, so the next step in the process is to find the little pink river area, and off to the side there, you'll see a blue tech cave lit up with a bunch of blue lights like this, and sitting in the middle of the floor will be this thing. You can go up to it and access the inventory, and that's where you place all your stuff you just spawned in. So we're gonna head over here and look at the Gamma, Beta, and Alpha. The Gamma just requires the three artifacts that we spawned in. The Beta is gonna require the artifacts, four Basilisk Scales, 12 Nameless Venom, two Reaper Pheromone, and also two Rock Drake Feathers. The Alpha version is going to require the artifacts, one Basilisk Fang, one Alpha Carcanos Claw, one Reaper King Barb, we're gonna need eight Basilisk Scales, 20 Nameless Venom, seven Reaper Pheromone Glands, and seven Rock Drake Feathers. Alright, so for this example, I'm just going to use the Gamma, just because I didn't spawn in enough of the other things to do the Alpha. So we're just going to put the artifacts over there, and we're going to initiate the Gamma version of this portal. So let's go ahead and issue that guy. There it is. Here starts that portal. Good thing I brought my Reaper Queen, huh? Alright, so we're just going to take our Reaper Queen, get in the middle there, so we make sure she comes with us. Because there's no way in Hades I'm going to beat this guy on my own. Then we just sit here and wait. And wait some more. How you guys doing? How's your day? Good? Yeah, mine's going pretty good. Got a little bit of a cold, but I'm getting over it. No big deal. Alright, here we go. Oh, then we spawn in here. Now we are in the Rockwell Arena. <laughs> and there's our good friend, the Rockwell boss. Showed you how to spawn him in already. Yep, he's... Big and spooky. All right. So guys, if you want to get here, these are the things you're gonna need. These are the commands we used in this video. Don't forget, if you are on a public server and you do have admin access, make sure to type in admin cheat down there at the bottom. Make sure you type in admin cheat in space before you use any of these commands or else they will not work. You can go ahead and pause right now if you need to. Keep in mind the numbers that are gold are the numbers that you can change to change the amount of that item you're spawning in. So instead of a one, you can type in 10 if you feel like it. All right, guys, if you like this video, you know what to do. And also don't forget to subscribe for more videos just like this one. If you have anything you wanna see spawned up in ARK, leave those in the comments down below because some of the best ideas come from you guys. I'm Fatty McButterpants, and I will see you guys next time. Click the box up top for a full playlist of all my admin command spawning videos. Click the bottom two boxes for some more videos you might like. Go ahead, do it. Do it. Now. <laughs>